Oh, hi. Oh, it has been a minute. I am so sorry for the delay. Uh, we've had a lot going on lately. I don't know if you noticed, but uh, check out the sunburn. Uh, yeah, so I don't know if you know, but we just spent the past weekend at the Pinellas Pepper Festival uh, working the Linda's Fiery Treats booth. It was freaking awesome. Uh, I saw all of my favorite people, got to watch the Pinellas Pepper League of Fire Championship. Uh, Jason Wamhoff was the winner, so that was really exciting. I got to meet uh, my sauce crush, which is Bombshell Sauces. Hold on a minute. Bombshell Sauce Co., which, um, look, I'm going to tell you this, all right? Uh, if you don't know about Bombshell, uh, I have reviewed some of their sauces. I love them. I have known of Bombshell for years. And I, I didn't know Bombshell, okay? And so when I saw these labels and these business cards, I assumed it was some dude that was like using this really beautiful cartoon character as a gimmick for their, their bottles, their labels. Until, one, I reviewed the sauces. There ain't nothing gimmicky about them. They are delish. Two, this is modeled after the maker because this is the maker. And she is just, she's more beautiful from the front. And if you can believe that, <laughs> she is more beautiful from the front. But I got to see her freaking awesome. You got to check out Bombshell Sauces. I'm a huge fan. But that's not the reason that we're here today. I just wanted to give you the update and let you know. Pinellas Pepper Festival was freaking awesome. Linda's Fiery Treats is banging. We got to come home with some of her awesome stuff, which yes, of course, we will be reviewing. But today, I have to get down on this review here that I told you about on Facebook and all of the other uh, platforms. I just hadn't gotten to it yet, so we're gonna do this now. This comes from my beloved Roger Damps of Burn Your Tongue Sauces out of Ogden, Utah. Roger has been such a huge supporter, not only of the channel, but of the store. And if it wasn't for him, uh, I wouldn't know a lot of the awesome sauces, sauce, sauces, the awesome sauces that uh, I tell you all about. So Roger's the coolest. And I'm super excited to see what's in this box and sharpen my knife. Okay. Okay. All right. So here's the moment that I have been waiting for. Roger Damps is out of Ogden, Utah. And sometimes he'll send me like sauces that he carries in his store called Burn Your Tongue Sauces. But most of the time what he sends me and makes me privy to are all of the awesome sauces out of Ogden, Utah. And then the ones that I love the most, I try and start carrying in the Cap Cave. Most recently, he sent me Lisa's. I fell in love with Lisa's. I'm just gonna tell you now, I did. I was a huge fan. I've been a huge fan of a lot of things. There are some sauces that have come out of Ogden, Utah that I, well, not necessarily Ogden, I always say that, out of Utah that I have loved. One uh, is right up there, that yellow one from Uncle Chainsaw, um, staring at the sun, <laughs> friggin' love it. Uh, Lisa's Heavenly Habanero, <laughs> friggin' loved it. And now we have this. this. I'm not gonna make you sit here and watch me fumble with all of these. So I will undress these sauces and be right back with you. Okay, I said that I wasn't gonna let you watch me open it, but you gotta, you gotta watch me open it. So, cause I get so excited and it just has to be shown. So this is Heat Street Dopamine Delivery since 2023. I'm a huge fan of that label right there because I don't know if you know this about me, but I am dopamine deficient. And that leads me to do some really dopey things. And uh, that's one of the main reasons that I'm so in love with hot sauce and peppers because it makes me happy and keeps me wholesome. But I gotta talk to you about this sauce, okay? Uh, so this comes from one of the first, if not the first, saucers that I ever reviewed for Burn Your Tongue. Uh, this comes from Bear River Bottling. I have to tell you, listen here, Lightning Bolt Buffalo. I, haven't, I have not had this sauce. This sauce has not graced my lips in years. And I still remember how fresh, clean, delicious, and blown away I was by this. I cannot wait to talk to you more about that. Now, uh, what do we have? Okay. Ah! Lisa's! This is a big box of goodies. Oh, I'm so excited. Yes. Okay, so this is a new one from Lisa's, also out of Utah. That's the one I was telling you about with the Heavenly Habanero. Loves it, loves it. We've got Uncle Lewis. It's coming. I'm telling you, it's coming. Okay, fine. Oh, God. Okay. <laughs> Great label. 
Let's get these out of here and then we'll get some method to the madness. <gasps> it's another one from Lisa's. It's like Christmas every time. Oh man. Smoking seven pepper, okay. Big fan of Lisa's. Lisa's is super cool. And then we've got another one. This is, wait, is this not the, these are all different. Hold on a minute. No, this is Heat Street. Okay, so we've got two from Heat Street, two from Lisa's, one from Bear River Bottling. Again, all of them out of Utah. Spiciest thing in the whole state. This is cool. Another one, Dopamine Delivery, Heat Street, Savvy Sauce, The Labels Man. Okay. A lot of people in the industry say that the, the label sells the bottle. Um, yeah. Yeah, I mean, and then sometimes I guess reviewers giving you a great review helps, but the labels really do, and those are fun. Oh, oh, I'm very excited here. Another one from Bear River Bottling that I have never had before. This is a new one. Cajun Ghost Story. Can't wait. Can't wait. Here's the thing about me. If you've never watched me before, I'm not your average uh, sauce content maker. Uh, I want flavor before heat. Now I have competed in pepper eating competitions. I will compete in more pepper eating competitions. You have probably seen me or possibly have seen me or could see me on Hulu, the spicy world of pepper people. I can take the heat. But that doesn't mean I always like to. I really love the culinary, <laughs> culinary approaches that people take to their sauces. Uh, I don't know if you know this about me, but I'm a stay-at-home mom and I work from home and I like to be in the comfort of my home, you know? However, when it comes to the sauce world, I feel like I'm traveling the entire world of sauce and flavor. It's been so cool. Once I started this, I've gone with some of my favorite brands like Linda's Fiery Treats or Mikey V's to different uh, hot sauce events throughout the country. Uh, and then when I'm at home doing the mom thing, I get to travel the world with all of these awesome flavors. Who do we have here? I didn't look. All natural, vegan, good, clean, no gums, no gimmicks, no preservatives. Don't worry, who is you? Flamin' Homers! Ah! So this is a new one from Flamin' Homers. You can go back through the channel and see where we've reviewed their sauces before. Very good. Cool. Is that all the goodies? All right, that's it. So let's lean it out. Let's lay it out. Roger Damps. Burn your tongue sauces. If you're ever in Utah, you got to go check them out. They have all the best sauces, and they are huge supporters of so many of us in the industry, not just their local brands. I'm in South Carolina. And Roger Dance has been supporting me from the very beginning. And you just can't beat that, you know? All right, so let's line them up. We got these two awesome sauces from Lisa's. Then we got Flamin' Homer. Then we've got this new brand that I am not familiar with, but super excited to find out about. Three there. And then we've got these two from Bear River Bottling. I am freaking thrilled. Love Roger Damps, love experiencing new sauces, love finding new sauces in old sauces, saucers, lines. Anyway, this is just an unboxing. We're gonna be working our way through these. I'm so excited, guys. I love you so much. Um, now that our schedule has sort of cleaned up a little bit from all the festivals and events, now we get back to the fun time, which is sampling sauces and finding out what we're gonna sling in the cat cave next and tell you guys all about. So I love you all so very much. You are my happy place in this world. And uh, God bless y'all, take care. Stay tuned uh, because we'll be reviewing these. And in the meantime, go check out the videos of the ones that we previously reviewed, the lines, just to get an idea of what they're all about. Please hit that like, follow, subscribe button, tell your mom all about me. Even if, uh, maybe don't tell your mom about me. Don't tell your mom about me. That could be our little secret. Anyway, uh, I love you guys. Goodbye.